Hey, what's up, guys? Jacob here, back with another video. It's been a while, but the new update for Street Fighter 5 came out, so I figured I'd kind of just make a video on my opinions on the, you know, the new adjustments to Birdie and just how I feel. I'm probably gonna play some. You know, I'm gonna make some videos, some matches online. Probably going to ranked, but in terms of like my opinions on it, I don't feel like it's that good. Like. The adjustments I mean I think they're great but I'm kind of just gonna go over like my opinion on like you know just some things they should have kind of done but yeah so the first thing is that his stand fierce now you can charge it and it, and it causes a knockdown right which is great you can recover off of it on defense right and I get the idea they wanted you know like when you're doing shit like this right or you're doing you know strings like that they want it to be a little more annoying for players that are trying to counter poke you right Especially players that are trying to get crush counter counter pokes, right? So it's definitely gonna make them think twice, maybe. You know what I mean? You know, 100 damage, that is a good amount of damage, right? But against a player that knows that they get one crush counter and literally drag you to the corner with a crush counter combo, they kind of will take the, those chances, right? In a sense, right? But that differs, right? Depending on the character, matchup, and, you know, other stuff. But yeah, so overall, it's. It could have been better, I feel like, if they made this cancelable with the, the V-Skills. Now, you could cancel in the V-Trigger, which is okay, I guess, you know what I mean? But if he was able to cancel into the V-Skill, I feel like it would be a lot more of a useful tool. You know, you get that hard knockdown, and now you set up your can or your banana. Maybe that might have been a little too much, you know what I mean? He'd, or at least, if you get the crush counter, maybe. You know, then you can get it, but no, there's nothing. It's almost the same thing, just a little more damage. Like, yeah, I can go into this, right? But I could already go into that from this range. And the only thing I can pretty much get at that range is this, right? So it's so obvious that those are my options. So you can kind of just sit there and wait to see a yellow birdie flying through the sky, right? And then just jump. But yeah. So, that's, it's good, but... Oh yeah, in the corner, I feel like it's a little more, like maybe better right you know since they're right there now you know you kind of can loop someone over and over again right but that's if they're, they're getting hit obviously but yeah it makes his corner game stronger what you know they when they made the chain i'm assuming they wanted him to get stronger mid-screen not in the corner or in this pressure game but it just made him a little stronger in the pressure game you know he can be a little more locked down the corner with it but i don't know but I understand the idea of delaying stuff to make it more annoying for the players that are trying to counter poke, right? Did this get faster? Or is it just because I'm seeing this so much prior? Then? Okay, but yeah. And the pushback. Damn, okay. So at least the charge one doesn't have too much pushback, which is great, but you can only get another one, right? Right? But Bird's corner game is already brutal, so like I feel like that's he didn't really need that adjustment to any corner game. Alright, next thing we'll go over is his crouch medium punch so this i'm confused about uh they made his minus two minus five crouch medium punch minus two so what does that do not much you know you know i could be a little more unga bunga but you see how bison recovered there right which is great right okay like now it could be a more unga bunga against players that are more unsuspected right I, you know, I'm like charging EX, you know, on offense, I'm charging EX, you know what I mean? Like, that doesn't really make sense, right? To be very unga bunga, right? I just don't understand that yet, like... I feel like this doesn't do anything, this not, you know, he has a strong game off of other options, right? Up close. I don't think this is really gonna do much, but now he's safe, right? Like, oh shit, I accidentally didn't confirm, right? Hey, I'm safe now. That's the only thing I feel like that does. You know what I mean? Because there are situations where you, like... But either way, on hit, it always links. Counter or non-counter. Light kick into this always links. But yeah. I, yeah, I, I, I'm trying to, like, see any practical use of this. And I just don't, like... Hey, I'm safe, right? That's, that's all I see, right? Hey, I'm safe. After doing a move that's useless up close. Yeah, I don't know, man. <coughs> I don't get it. You drop a combo, maybe, now you're safe, right? So yeah, that helps that. So that's cool, right? So, yeah, yeah, I don't... I don't understand. That one I'm confused about. I don't know if there's anything, like, with that, like, you know... 
Uh, if there's something I'm missing, just let me know in the comments, you know, if there's something I'm missing about it. But yeah. And the adjustment to jump heavy punch too, like, they made it, uh, what is it, uh... It like knocks you down faster or something. But you can quick rise. Like, okay, I get an air there, you, you get knocked down faster, right? Okay. Like... And I get Oki, right? That's cool. Like, he is plus after, so that's great, but... Why? I, I, I don't know. Before it was a trade, right? Yeah. I believe, like, you hit someone there, the air recover, right? I believe you're still plus sometimes. But I guess now you're a lot, you're a lot more plus, but you can just back roll if you get hit mid-screen there. And then I, I kind of lose pressure there. And it's back to the, the roll of a dice or just sitting there and just waiting and poking you. The, so, okay, that's not terrible, but yeah. It's... Uh, it's like a okay, you know what I mean? I'll take it, right? Now the other thing he got was a buff to his forward heavy punch. The bull charge. Uh, that has armor and everything. You know, it's good for a counter projectile sometimes up close. So they, they gave more active frames, which is nice. It recovers faster on whiff, so that's nice. It's two frames faster on recovery. So I guess you could spam it more and, and like fish out a crush counter from a zoner. So I don't know. I heard they buffed zoning a little bit for some characters. So even though they sped up this, they sped up other character zoning. So it, it just becomes useless and only gets better in matchup that it was already good in. I'm assuming. So yeah, I, yeah. I don't know. This is looking like more of like a matchup, like game, like matchup. You know. Yeah, it's, it's looking like a matchup game. But yeah. I'm not surprised why a lot of high-low players are just constantly switching characters, because, yeah. But, besides that, go on to the next move. So the EX Dolphin Dive got buffed, now he recovers 3 frames faster, so... The good thing about this is now he gets a, a media slide, which is great. Now it can be minus 3 off a of slide, right? Which is amazing, right? Now you can go for space traps and stuff, now you're, you're safer, right? So that's, that's great. All right. So they gave that to Barry. I feel like he should have had that already a while ago. You know what I mean? Before he was punishable after doing that. Now he kind of gets more of a mix up game. You know? yeah. Right? And because it recovers faster, it's a little harder to kind of detect the dolphin dive a little bit. But against a player that, that knows that I recover a little faster, they just got to be a little more ready. That's all. Yeah. But online, I can see how this can be a little more annoying. You know what I mean? Because online, you, you're more you're less dependent on your reactions and more of preemptive knowledge. And, you know, it, yeah, it's every, uh, there's more preemptive stuff going on online for sure than offline. Right? And I feel like it's mostly because a lot of players have that idea that, you know, I, I don't want to depend on my reactions because then I'm going to get screwed up by the frame delay and yeah, but yeah. It's not important, but yeah. So yeah, they, they made adjustments to that, which is great. I feel like he needed that. Did he have that before, I, I believe? Or I think his, his slide was faster before. So he was able to get a meaty, and then they, they toned down the slide, and it made it worse than the Dolphin Dive, and now they buffed Dolphin Dive, which gives them back the slide. Like, it's like recycling, but not recycling. You know what I mean? They're giving him back what he had, but in a different way, right? Like, that's what I'm seeing, it seems like. But I don't know, uh, I believe that's it. I don't know if there's any more. I'm, I'm reading the passage right now, and... Uh, there's anything I'm missing, but patch notes are here, and I believe I went over everything. Just let me know how you guys feel, and I don't know. I'm definitely gonna go, come back a little bit and play, you know, just to see what's going on. With the new patch, I might, you know, hop on some other characters. Maybe it depends, but yeah. But yeah, just stay tuned, you know. I'm definitely gonna be probably come back and play a little bit, but yeah, yeah it's just like let me know how you guys feel about the new patch for Birdie, and if you guys are still holding down or Birdie and stuff. Yeah, just let me know. Uh, but yeah, with that, I am out. See you guys later. Peace.